Good morning, everybody. Hope you're doing well. Today we're going to take a look at the Epistogramma Agazizii Tefe Pearl Blues. These are a lovely little dwarf cichlid. Um, they are from Tefe, which is in Brazil. Um, they're very easy to breed. They like a pH neutral to the low sixes. We find that in the low sixes they do breed easier. Um, they do like to have a substrate of fine sand because they do like to dig. They are a type of microgeophagus. So they like to sift through the sand and look for little things to eat and munch on. Uh, you want to feed them a varied diet. You want to make sure they get some roughage. Um, brine shrimp is really good with them. You also want to make sure that you have driftwood in your tank. Um, some leaf litter works really well. You can use almond leaves or really any kind of leaf litter works well. For breeding purposes, they are a cave breeder. So what we have found that works really well, we'll come over to this tank over here so I can show you. This is a pod that we got from Tannin Aquatics and they work so well because they're nice and small. Um, the females find them easy to protect with the small opening, but there's enough room in there um, for them to breed. So those always work really well when you're trying to breed any kind of epistogramma, really. As far as filtration goes, we're just using some sponge filters in here, and that's working out really well for them. As you can tell, there's a male right there, and they tend to have a lot more color as most epistogramma breeds do. Um, they do have that beautiful pearl blue and yellows and all different kinds of colors. They're just a beautiful fish. All right, guys, well, that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to like and subscribe and comment. If you have any questions, we're always available, or you can email me at ann at escapeaquatics.com. And always remember to escape a little every day.